Dawn Chorus is an absolute joy to behold, but have you thought about recording it to play it back later? Hi there, I'm Rob Cottle, I'm a Mother Nature lover and photographer and OM System Ambassador. I've got some hints, some tips and settings for you to use with your digital recorders. So I'm using the LSP5, but the settings are basically the same for all digital recorders. I'm using it on a really basic tripod, doesn't have to be anything special, and that's just to avoid handling noise. And I'm also using a windshield because you're surprised how even the gentlest of breeze can spoil a recording. Now before I even leave the house, I set up some general settings. Besides remembering to recharge the batteries, I also turn off all the automatic modes such as automatic levels, voice sync, limiting and low filters. And this is basically so we can record in manual mode so that we're still in control. I also check that we're recording in the PCM format and this is basically so that we keep all the information to process later, similar to raw files in a camera. Now, location-wise, we really want to find somewhere relatively quiet, something like a local park or wood, and this is basically because birds' larynxes are no match for noisy life. If you're recording first thing in the morning, just like wildlife photography, you want to be in place as early as possible with all your equipment prepared and set up. Now, for the dawn chorus, that can mean a couple of hours before sunrise. Right, so now that we've set everything up and we've found ourselves a spot to sit, all that remains is to press the record, and we can do that now in two ways. Firstly, we can of course press the record button on the record itself, and we can adjust the levels using the forward and rewind buttons. Or we can use the new app, and this allows a little bit more detail, but also the added benefit of being further away from the recording, which stops us from making a noise next to the recorder. Also helps, hopefully, bring the birds in closer. We want to keep our levels as high as possible, but we want to avoid distortion. So keep your peaks below minus 12 dB on the scale, unless you want your robin to sound like the singer of a heavy metal band. Keep adjusting your levels right throughout the recordings if necessary. So once done, all we gotta do is press pause if you wanna remain recording later, or stop. So should you want to go into a little bit more detail about recording, there's a comprehensive blog up on the OM System website called Hark the Feathered Angel Sing, which I happen to have written. So there you go. I really hope you have a chance to enjoy the Dawn Chorus, as being serenaded by the Avian Orchestra is truly a magical experience. And please remember that birds are trying to stay alive, and if we are too much of a nuisance, it could be costly to them. So please look after our feathery friends. Hopefully that was helpful. Take care.